Sponsored by Route 66 Solar. 510 on this Monday morning. Well, it sounds like, Nick, you had a very eventful weekend. What about yourself, Mark? A uh, very chill weekend. Tried to enjoy the weather. Spent a lot of time outside. Had yeah. some friends over on the patio. It's what you got to nice. do here yeah. in early October. It's good to have everyone back. You had a uh, an exciting weekend as well. Did you actually go through with the haunted hayride? I know we're all waiting a bated breath. Oh, I didn't hear about this. To know. <laughs> yes, because you did. She, was, she is, so on Thursday too, we, I teased her. I said, I need to know. We, we the people, need to know if you're actually going to go through with the haunted hayride. And you did. I did. You did it? Wow. Yeah. Proud of you. Hashtag yeah. proud. Yeah, it, it was great. <laughs> you know. It was great? Was it scary? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> so if you want to be scared, let's. Yeah, no, well, I was just going to say, he was driving, like, really fast. I actually realized I've never been on a hayride, like, at all. You've been on oh. a hayride, even? Wow. No. Been that on many hayrides. Hay no haunted hayrides. Yeah, not but a haunted The one. speed was the thing that was m the most scary thing, I, oh, from what I'm Probably. It was just so dark once I realized, you know, that we were out. I'm like, oh, wow, it is really dark out <laughs> That's here. That's what happens. You get these fields out yeah. here. There's not a lot of light. Nick, this is the this is the week though to take advantage of all this stuff because oh, yeah. again, yeah. as we get closer to Halloween, it's more fun maybe to do that stuff. But right now the weather's great. It's so nice. It's just not maybe pumpkin carving week. You know, it's uh, going to be a little too warm, I think, for that. But outside of that, my goodness, is it going to be fantastic here? I always say wait till the first frost to get the pumpkins carved, just because then the bugs aren't as much of an issue. You're not worried about the pumpkins uh, making it to Halloween. Because if you carve now, it's going to be dicey if uh, you're leaving those pumpkins outside. I will say our temperatures this morning, this was more in line with what we think of October. Low 40s out there in a couple of spots. Champagne at 41. We're at 51 in Decatur. Live look outside. I got no issues for you folks again. It will be a nice little warm up here, upper 60s this afternoon. This is very much a seasonable day. Our average high temperature right around 72, 73 degrees. So by the time we wrap up this afternoon, as soon as the sun goes down again, boom, we get that temperature dropping quick. It will be clear, nothing on the satellite radar. It's not just here in central Illinois. Let me zoom back out here. There's really nothing on this side of the country here. You get up towards Maine, yeah, you got a little bit of rain right there. Florida, getting a few showers, but the central part of the country, fantastic stuff. So if you're, uh, I don't know, maybe heading over to Kansas City, it's a game tonight that I have a vested interest in, boy, you will be loving this, really a football field today. No issues here. I could fast forward the next weather maker. I could start right now all the way into the middle of this week. You're not going to see anything. A couple of clouds maybe north of us. Boy, that's about it. Tuesday morning we wake up. Very chilly start. Right around 40 degrees. Sunshine comes out. Here we go. Warming right back up. A little bit warmer Tuesday, Wednesday. A repeat of what we have on Tuesday. Again, slightly warmer each day. Feels like temperatures are fantastic. No humidity. Really no winds through the middle of this week. You're good to go if you have any outdoor plans. I don't have anything to track yet. Of course, that's how we started last week, and then we saw what happened on Friday. So we'll keep an eye on things for you. But temperatures will be the big story over the next few days. 40 degrees tonight. Tomorrow, we wake up. It's feeling good again. Low 40s, fast warm-up. We end up in those uh, mid-70s, I think, in the afternoon. Tomorrow might be the nicest day of the entire week as far as just that feels like temperature, getting almost that perfect level of 75 and sunny out there. For me, that's always my goal. To get to that number and it's going to feel really comfortable here chilly overnights in the 40s right back into the uh, upper 70s and low 80s by wednesday we are steady no rain chances at all at least for now through the weekend and then it does look a little bit cooler heading into next week thanks for watching stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video